right? People are gonna think we're imperfect. And if you think about that, what most girls will do is they'll put deodorant in their hair and they'll say, oh, I have to go home, hide me, get me out of the back door, I can't stay here. She went to work the next day, served people, and she said she'd say to them, I have to tell you what happened last night. When, and she told them about putting deodorant in her hair. I love to laugh, and my daughter loves to laugh. All my daughters do. But what's happened is, with the economy the way it is, you pick up the newspaper and you read it. Charter to file, bar, file for bankruptcy. Conflicts prompt nominee to pull out. Economists have dim view of compromise package. Everything I looked here was scary. And I thought, we get up in the morning and we look at this newspaper and say, you know what? Life isn't fun anymore. What actually happened is, not after 9-11, people laughed a lot more before 9-11. And 9-11 happened, and people said, you know what? Life isn't fun anymore. What's the bottom line? How much money do we have? We have to be really, really serious now. You know what? Life is made up of it's art and science. The science is technology, and that's changing all the time. The art is humor, and for some reason, people have let the humor go. It's like we can let that go, but that's where the fun is in life. Now, how many times do you think a two-year-old laughs a day? Do you remember? 400 times a day on average. I mean, you think about it. They spill milk. If they spill milk, do we laugh at it? <laughs> They laugh at everything. They laugh when they hurt someone. They laugh at everything. They laugh at the dumb things on TV. Now adults, as adults, how many times a day do you think the average adult laughs? <coughs> 15. Five, you know what, and that's good. You know what, I speak on this a lot. I do whole seminars on, on humor and, and uh, laughter as a relationship connector. What's amazing is most people say they don't laugh 15 times a day. I think I do the laughing for those that don't laugh 15 <laughs> times. <laughs> but I had people come up to me after and say, after seminars and say, can you coach me? I don't know how to laugh anymore. It's like, you don't know how to laugh anymore? And so I, I uh, coach people and taught them how to find the fun in, in uh, laughter in life. 